Okay, three, two, one. Okay, today we're going to be seeing what happens when you put a real diamond in molten lava. Will the diamond actually burn or melt or what will happen? So these are the lava rocks we're gonna be using. I'll put them in my furnace, melt them down, and then we'll drop the diamond into it. Okay, we're getting close. Okay, here we go. Okay, three, two, one. Oh gosh, I missed. Okay, I missed the whole hot lava and it's in the bottom glowing down there. Okay, you can see it at the bottom there glowing. <laughs> okay, I missed my hot lava, but luckily the whole bottom is actually filled with lava. Okay, I'm going to drop it down in here like this now. Okay, there it is. Let's take it out and see what it looks like. Okay, so you can actually see it glowing in the middle there. So it's actually glowing brighter than the lava around it. That's probably because it's starting to burn and it's creating its own heat. Okay, let's stick it back in the furnace and see if it can actually burn in there. Cause right now it's just sitting on top of the lava. Okay, I stuck it back in here. Let's heat it up and see what the diamond looks like after it's been heated up for a while. Okay, let's try to get the diamond out now. Ah, see it glowing in there. Okay, I think we got it somewhere in here. Okay, so I think the diamond's still in here. Let's see if we can find it. I think that's it right there. Okay, so here it is. You can see the diamond in there. See if we can get it out. Looks fine, it's just cloudy now. So there definitely was a reaction with the surface of it, but not enough to really physically damage it in a large way. You can see that this, you can see that it still has the same shape as before. So diamond can burn, but it takes a lot of oxygen to get it to burn. Because it's made of pure carbon, it can still turn into CO2, but you have to have a lot of oxygen to do it. So if you heat a diamond up and put it in liquid oxygen, it will burn. Or if you just flow oxygen past it, pure oxygen and heat it up, it should burn as well. So diamond versus lava, the diamond wins. Thanks for watching another episode of The Action Lab. I hope you liked it. Remember to subscribe if you haven't subscribed and check out theactionlab.com if you haven't seen the Action Lab subscription box yet. And thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.